not, this is not my dorm room. Because we had to evacuate. Happy hurricane season! <laughs> okay, everything, I think is fine. There was just a hurricane uh, in the Gulf of Mexico currently called Helene, and it's kind of going towards Tampa, up kind of by Tallahassee, Florida. So we had to leave because the University of Tampa is right on the river, and then on the other side, not too far from us in the grand scheme of things, is the Tampa Bay. So. <laughs> Not really ideal to have a bunch of college kids there during a storm, so they just told us to evacuate because of flooding, mostly to be honest. So now I'm at my grandparents house in Naples! Yay! Um, very fun. We just went to Target and to Publix <laughs> for just like, well just like some like food and stuff like that and then because I'm stupid and I was packing yesterday, I brought everything. I, the counter that the, or like the dresser that the camera is currently on, I brought my, I brought my Kelly hair product, I brought deodorant, I brought makeup, I brought my skincare, I brought my vitamins, I brought sunscreen just in case it got nice down here over the next few days, I brought perfume, I brought my hairbrush, I brought my little like get ready with me like headband, I brought everything. You wanna know what I didn't bring? Everything that's currently sitting in my shower at school. So I didn't bring a body wash, I didn't bring shampoo, I didn't bring conditioner, I didn't bring my face wash. So we went to Target and I had to get all of that stuff. And I also got shoes. I'm gonna show you the shoes because they're really cute. Ah! Okay, I'm probably gonna vlog the rest of the week slash weekend, but I had to get shoes. Because the shoes that I ordered on Amazon for the preference round of Rush, they might not get here now for Saturday because of the storm. They're supposed to be delivered today, but I don't know the situation with that, especially because campus is closed with the mountain and everything. So Target, Target pulled through with silver shoes. Um, yeah, it's kind of it right now, so I just thought I'd vlog. <laughs> First hurricane of college. Oh, also, yesterday, me and my roommate Natalie and our friends, uh, Sarah and Kaylee, we went to go get our nails done yesterday, because you know how I, like, totally, like, ripped all my acrylic nails off before I came down here? We found it, well, Sarah and Lauren found this place. $30 for a fresh full set. Like absolutely gorgeous. They look exactly like the picture I showed her. You know that song on TikTok where it's like, I'm me again. It feels like it's been years. That That's how I feel now. Cause I have nails again. I felt like I felt naked without my nails. I'm happy. We found a place to get nails. And Phil's, Phil's are $25. And they were so nice there and they're so good. I'm just happy to have nails again. <laughs> yeah. Also, what are some other, I'm trying to think of any other updates. Oh, me and Kaylee did tech for a student run production through APO this semester. We just closed last weekend and we did a Harry Potter musical. If you are part of the niche segment of the Harry Potter fan base that is also a theater kid, you know what that is. And it is so funny. Literally died mid-sentence, so I'm gonna wrap it up on the iPhone footage. Um, yeah, we did tech for Harry Potter musical, and it was so much fun. Yeah, so, if you know, you know, but everyone that saw it said it was like, it was so amazing, it was so funny, the cast was great, and our friend Oliver, who is also a freshman musical theater major, was Harry Potter! It was very fun. Um, I made new friends, got to know, like, more people in the musical theater program. It was so fun, it was so fun, and I've never, like, been like on like backstage crew before like i've helped out backstage before but i've never been part of like legit crew like moving set pieces like doing like all that stuff and it was so fun it was so fun highly highly recommend if you get the chance to be involved in that at some point do it it's so fun it is so much 
fun. So, yes. So stay tuned for, I guess, the hurricane weekend slash rush vlog. I don't know, man. <laughs> camera's been successfully recharged because it um it cut me off earlier and that was really that was really mean um because it died when it said the battery was full well, the battery was not full but um you know because you're obviously watching this not on a wednesday because i'm not posting this on a wednesday unless you are watching it on a wednesday then um cool i'm trying where can i set this up so you can see the fit and then put it up here so Today is Wednesday, which means it is, for me, this Wednesday is for Agatha All Along, episode three. Very exciting. So, you know, we got the, we got our purple on. We're ready. We're excited. Um, personally, I love that Patty Lapone is in this as... A Reno Sweeney girly is a Broadway girly. Patty the Pwn, the queen that she is. Also, everyone else in the show. Also, Joe Locke. Eating it up every time. Eating it up. Eating it up every word that comes out of his mouth. Mm-hmm. 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 Also, as a book girly, because you know I love Heartstopper. I read all the books, and season three coming soon. So, yeah. Also, just says I have to put my nerdy little two cents in. Uh. Jolex's character, Teen, is definitely Billy Kaplan. Um, if you don't know who that is, Billy Kaplan, who is technically Billy Maximoff, one of Wanda's twins, because the twins' souls get put into different bodies in the comics. It's a whole thing, but I think Jolex's character, Teen, is Billy Kaplan, aka Wiccan, because we have a lot of the Young Avengers planted throughout different bits of Marvel right now, but that's my two cents so far. Good morning. I say good morning. It's almost noon, but you know, I was up at 2 a.m. because we got a lovely glaring tornado warning. That was fun. Um, oh, finished the episode of Agatha all along because of course I did. I have determined that Joe Locke's character is either Nicholas Scratch, which is Agatha Harkness's son, if you've read the comics, or he's Billy Kaplan, aka Wiccan, because they name dropped Mephisto for the first time in the MCU, if you were there for the WandaVision era, you know what I'm talking about. Um, we all remember the, the Mephisto being the fly on the wall theory. Sorry, I was reading text message. <clears throat> so, well, that's the theory on that. Um, sorry, I'm looking at the palm trees because, no, focus, please focus. I'm just gonna zoom in. They're just blown away out there. They're just they were just blowing away. Welcome to Florida. Um did I zoom out enough? Okay. Welcome to Florida. Yeah. So yeah, that's currently where we're at. I got a lovely little tornado warning at like 1.30 this morning and I was up until 2 a.m. Um Yeah. It's like rained here. But that's about it. So yeah, we'll see what the school says for when we're allowed to come back on campus. So, yeah. <clears throat> Guess who officially has been invited to preference? We got our little email and a text message this morning. I'm so excited. Although it is on Zoom because we're still not allowed back on campus because, oh, it is now, it's Friday morning, by the way. And yes, I am wearing the same sweatshirt that I was wearing yesterday in the morning. And I don't care. I, I don't care. So, yeah. So, preference is tomorrow at 1 via Zoom because we're still not back 
but we're still not allowed on campus. And it's not because campus is like destroyed. Campus is fine. We just have there's no power or anything, so they can't really oh, like no power. No, campus has no power. That was part. That was that's, that's really problem. yeah. We have no power on campus right now. That's really why we're not allowed back. Yeah, it could be days. <laughs> yeah, they're like campus is fine. Like everything's fine. There's just no power, so they can't really have us like. Well, that creates a little bit of an issue. Yeah, they're like, you just can't go live in your dorm if we have no power. Yeah, no air conditioning, no nothing. No nothing. Like that means like the elevators won't work or anything, which nope. means our, if we have no power, that means our key cards won't work. Fire alarms probably don't work. Yeah, and like our like I, our student IDs, they get us in to everywhere. So. Oh well, I guess you're staying here. Tonight, yeah. Huh? All right, unless it won't be raining too yeah. much. Yeah. Go grab something for dinner tonight somewhere. Sure. Oh yeah, it's like we're fine here in Naples. Um, this blue sky. It like rained a little bit this morning, but it it it's fine. I got it this morning and I was like, the sun's out. I was like, well, there's the hurricane. The sun's well, it out. it goes by. It came here first. Yeah, so we, so we're good now. Also, I'd like to thank the box of coffee that the camera is currently on because my tripod, it's not in my dorm room. No, no, no. It's in New Jersey. So um, the camera is currently sitting on top of a box of coffee because that's... Are you talking to somebody? No, it's the oh. vlog. <laughs> Your vlog? <laughs> Oh, great. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the update. Virtual preference, we're still not allowed on campus. And the sun's out! <laughs> Ooh! Ow, I just ran into the wall. Okay. Preference, fit. Dress is from Hollister, and it is gorgeous. We love it. Little spin, little spin. And then the shoes are the ones that I showed the other day. Because, yes, I did put the shoes on to sit on a Zoom call in kitchen. It's fine. Also, we just got off, and um, she's a Zeta. Never thought I'd be saying that in a million years, but here we are. And I'm doing this because I'm not going to post this until after bid day. So, yeah, we did it. As you can see, we're back at school. Welcome to a practice room at the University of Tampa. They're very nice. Hey! So, for my oral skills class, it's basically like ear training with music kind of a thing. I don't know how else to describe it. We do these little, we send in little videos to him every week. Oh, that's fine. So, but I figured out the easiest way for me to do this one is to pluck out the notes on the piano so I can hear it. This is currently the piano. <laughs> I ripped pieces off of it, of a piece of notebook paper, and they're currently right there. Phone is set up to record. The textbook is labeled, and we're just gonna go for it, and we're gonna see what happens. Okay, attempting to vlog while walking through campus for the first time. Here we go. Oh, there's people walking towards me. Shit, okay. Anyway picked up Wrath of the Triple Goddess from the mailroom. She made it here. I pre-ordered new Percy Jackson book. She's here. I'm very excited. Hold on a minute. We're going to walk past the people. Okay. We're good. So, yeah. Also, um, the giant tour group walking past me on my way to the mailroom. Really, really humbling. Um, it's really awkward walking past tour groups on campus because I'm like, mm, like, hey, like, it's so awkward. Like, I'm just trying to go to class. Oh, I'm going back to my room now. Class is over. But, book, very excited. Yay. We're back in the room. I'm going to open the book now. Um, I hope y'all can't see my address. I'll figure it out. Figure that out when I watch this later. It's campus address. Who cares? <gasps> She's pretty. Oh, she is. Oh, oh my god, wait, spray edges? Wait! Why is I didn't know we were gonna do spray edges. I didn't know that was a thing Ooh. on the Barnes and Noble edition of Wrath of the Triple Goddess. 
<laughs> she's beautiful. She's gorgeous. I love her more than anything in this world. Um, I'm so excited. Oh, it's called the senior year. Oh, it says senior year adventures on the bottom. I love the new covers. I'm sorry. Let's look at the inside. Oh, <gasps> wait. That's sick. There's like pictures on the inside. Wait. Oh, oh, they're different mitts. That's the freaking mitt minotaur. <laughs> Furies. I forgot who that is. <laughs> There's so many characters in Greek mythology. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay. I'm a full grown adult. <laughs> Oh, there's more in the back. I'm a full grown adult and this is a middle grade book series. Who cares? It's fine. Yeah, anyway, okay. I'm so excited. So I was really scared this wasn't going to get here because um, of the hurricane. It literally got delivered the day we got evacuated. So I was like, hmm, really hope my book that I pre-ordered gets there. And it did. Oh, the dedication to our friends at 20th TV and Disney Plus. We couldn't imagine a better crew to, oh, to sail into the sea of monsters. That's cute. Season two, I'm ready. Oh, I'm ready. I'm going to finish this in like three days. Probably. Anyway, um, I'm currently reading Interview with a Vampire. I'm taking a break from Interview with the Vampire. I said I wasn't going to do that, but I'm taking a break from Interview with the Vampire and I'm going to friggin' speed read Percy Jackson because that's what I do every time I get my hands on a new Percy Jackson book. Well, speaking of actually the end of this week for this new hurricane, you'll be done with that one. Oh and yeah, the there's another one. hurricane in the Gulf. Woo! Yay! Oh, also the, you know, just ghostly voice y'all are hearing in the background. Hi. That's Natalie. She's my roommate. <laughs> <laughs> we love her. <laughs> I'm like, I realized like halfway through, I'm like, oh, yeah, you're just a thing. random voice. Just a voice in the background, <laughs> it's fine. So, book. Okay, um, big day happened. Sure, it's Zeta. Zeta. Maddie's wearing the hat. Zeta. We got cannoli things for the road. I don't like yeah. this one though. The chocolate was better. Oh. Yeah, the chocolate chocolate the oh my god, I'm gonna be on YouTube. You are. Wait, this is going on YouTube? Yes. Are you famous? <laughs> <laughs> outro. No. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not. That's anyway, guys, make her famous. Oh, okay. make her famous. Ah!